Hey everybody, welcome back to Power Mods. Today I'm going to get a bunch of things cleaned up. One of them is this running boards. Now these running boards came off the ZX chassis. We have to modify them to fit this Rev chassis a little bit because we just didn't feel like going out and spending a whole bunch of money on some new boards. So, and to tell you the truth, I really like these ones. I get no snow build up, I got lots of traction, nice and wide to flip from one side to the other. They just work really well. There was a bar that came across here on the ZX chassis. So we cut that off. We're just gonna make a little piece of rounded tube that goes in here, mounts up nice and high. We'll put this little bracket here on the back. I can bolt it onto the side and then I'll come in and rivet a bunch of holes here. So that's the mission right now. Now that's just three quarter inch Aluminum stock tubing. We just used a big pipe bender to bend it. Made that nice little angle. I just have to come in, trim this out. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna use this piece that came off it as a bit of a template. This is one of those fit and trim kind of things. What? Actually, you're okay height-wise. Perfect. Okay, I gotta grind. Now, aluminum's pretty tricky to weld, and we're just using a spool gun on a, on a MIG welder. So I'm going to have to make sure that this is as clean as I can possibly get it. Got to get all this powder coating off here before I do anything. Everybody asked where I got these boards, and these actually came off a ZX chassis that a guy parted out, out west. And a fellow by the name of Billy Hine from Hine Racing made them. He and his buddies made them one night in the shop, I guess. Fabricating is what they like to do and save a little bit of cash. So he made them and you can find him on backcountryrebels.com. He's all over there. I think it's under Hein Racing. So check him out. See if he'll build something up for you. Not sure if he does custom work now or if he's just a guy having some fun like us. I gotta weld this up. Nobody laugh at my welds. It's a spool gun. It's not a TIG. Remember that. So I'm just gonna rivet the boards on from the bottom and that should pretty much wrap it up. I'm just gonna go in and chisel that out as well. There's no sense having that there when we want all the snow to evacuate. I gotta thank you guys for coming back. You know, first place part sells boards that are very similar to these. They're made by skins. So if you wanna buy a nice set of boards, get rid of that snow, stop carrying that extra weight around, give firstplaceparts.com a call, tell them Louie from PowerMod sent you. Check us both out on Facebook and make sure you give me a big old thumbs up on YouTube. Thanks for watching, I'm Louis Skibo.